guys. So my dilemma here with the 6S Typhon is you cannot run two 3S batteries in this. You have to run a 6S or a 4S. But I put a 3S and a 2S and it adds up to 5S and guess what? It works. Now it thinks it's 6S. There we go. Um, so I now have it linked up to my radio link um, transmitter and receiver. I've never run any 6S car on 5S. This is, uh, this is a first for me. I have read about it and they said the only thing you have to do is go into the low voltage cutoff and change that, turn it off. I haven't done that, but it still runs, so I don't know. Boy, it looks like my shocks have been already, but there's just a pitch to them. So I'm going to try this out and see how it works. Back to you in a second. Well, I'll tell you, it didn't help a whole lot. It, it's still, uh, the body's still kind of riding up high. It fits in there, though. Um, it's a little bit shorter than my two uh, 3S um, Pavway soft packs that also made the body rise up and um, actually I couldn't even put the pin on in this side uh, but this all seems to fit together let's see how she works okay um, steering's a little wonky because uh, I just put a my new receiver in there uh, Get it going straight. Well, it's a lot peppier than it was on 4S. I'll tell you that right now. There's a million cars in the parking lot, so there's a game going on. But I kind of just wanted it, wanted to test it out on the track and maybe a couple of the jumps. Uh, but um, so. The two batteries I have in here, a 3S and a 2S, they are both 5200 milliamp, um, and they're, 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 it's not important that they're the same C discharge, just don't run them all the way down to the bottom. That's, that's what you're going to have to pay attention to, oh, is uh, voltages. Now it'd be nice to have some kind of, ooh. So I'm also using these Hobby Park. Um, naturally. I'm also using these Hobby Park tires. Um, and I used them yesterday on 4S. I'm going to use them today on 5S. Uh-oh. Yeah, okay. Something, something's not right. So I'm not going to push it, evidently. The low voltage cutoff does have to be uh, turned off. So I'm going to stop this. I think I have a 4S battery. I'll stick that in it. I'll move this out of the way. There we go. Back in a second. Okay. Until I can get the uh, low voltage cutoff turned off, I'm going to run 4S. Wow, where did everybody come from? Two seconds ago, there was nobody here. The second I pull my car out, fills up. They call that Murphy's Law. So, so this is my, I have two of these Hubo 4S batteries. I only have one with me. Uh, the other one's drained from yesterday. grass is kind of deep. That's fine because these tires ride a little higher than the stock tires. So yeah these are the Hobby Park 17 millimeter wheels for this sized buggy. Used them on my ooh 3S Typhon first. That's the thing is this thing really digs in in the grass and 
so yeah I like these tires a lot and uh, this is my second run with the 6S Typhon with these tires. Now I know stock armor tires are really tough um, so I'm not worried about that but they, the rubber wears really quickly on most of the tires. The, the Vortex tires hold up good. Ooh, a little wobbly. Um, but the rubber on these tires lasts forever. I'm interested to see how they cope with 6S. Success. Yeah. But uh, with my 3S car, 3S Typhon, they've lasted a long time and they, they still have a lot of tread. Even after I cracked them. I don't want to do a bunch of that. No. I, I don't want to. I don't like picking dust and dirt out of the innards. Ooh. So one of the things you can do is um, you can change these wing mounts. I already bought some RPM wing mounts. They have more flex to them. Ooh. They have more flex so when you crash they're going to bend instead of uh, transferring the all the way to the crash to your diff case. You don't want that. Um, so consider that if you plan on upgrading to uh, aluminum wing mounts for any of your cars. That aluminum is going into your plastic diff cases. So um, once you take a hit all that power, all that weight is going to be transferred right to that plastic dip case and you're done for. You're out of the game. Instead of just having a broken wing or a wing mount, now you're, you're toast and you're in it for at least the cost of another plastic dip case. Um, but if you, if you want to upgrade to the metal, then, you know, you can do just one for like, you know, probably with the case and they make you buy the the cap the cover for it as well separately for another twenty four dollars so it's like fifty it's about seventy bucks all said and done and even more if you get the the sway sway bar um, holder it's just a little flap of plastic on these cars but for aluminum one it's like eleven bucks or something <laughs> Ooh, that grass is really deep around there. So yeah, 4S is just not real exciting with this car. It'll keep it alive though, I'll tell you that. You know, unless you're nose diving and you need some juice and you don't have it because you're 4S. But yeah, I really love my uh, Radio Link remote. See, there's not a lot of wheel spin on 4S to get out of something if you start nose diving. Um, you don't have a lot to play with. Yeah, I'm trying to find the idea. Probably right here on this corner is the, the part with the least abrupt beginning. Yeah, all these boys just come up out of the mountain because it's almost time to go, so they're doing their final. So, my lesson is get here uh, about a half hour earlier if I want to, because they'll, they'll still be up on the mountain. Right now, everybody's coming down off the mountain, getting ready to leave. So, it's a little late for me. So, yeah, um, I'm going to try that 5S again. Once I mess with the ESC uh, settings. Plus, I, I'd really like to give that um, <clears throat> that Hobby Wing motor fan a, a test. I already know it's good because I got it in the Crayon. Um, my Mojave already had one. The guy had put an Arma one on there. He really decked that thing out, and I got it for. 450. There was a lot of goodies on that, like the chassis skin, um, that motor fan, um, 
and some other things too. Um, but yeah, here they all come. Here they come. Here comes the bastard bury your head. Okay. Let's see if I get a quick little run up through the grass here. Which I shouldn't be doing. Tear up my discs. Forest isn't real exciting. Got a little bit of wetness to the grass. Kind of makes my car nice and clean. Huh? It's, it's no slouch though, I gotta say. For us, it's, it's still fun. Yeah, I wanna, I wanna put these tires to the test. I might have too much, uh, cause, but I've been jumping, you know, so I got a lot of tension on the springs. Mosquitoes are coming out. Yeah, so these tires are really sweet. I, I like them a lot. As you can tell, I haven't stopped talking about them, but if anything's going to put a tire to the test, it's, it's stuff like this. Jumps and ripping the stuff up. Let's get her clean again. That's we. For me. I don't know what that means. One of my buddies just called me. Something I like doing is we like scooping this bowl right here. Just going as flat out as you can, but like I said, for us. Not too uh not too exciting. Let me try to um, huh. Is that getting any bigger? I ain't getting any bigger. Why isn't it? I'm supposed to uh Huh. I don't know why my zoom isn't working. That sucks. Alright, well. Let's do another. Yeah. Huh. Yeah, I guess that's about right. It's about how the... I swear, if I got my... My other type in now, I think I've got it in the house, though. But yeah, I am super bummed about not being able to fit two 3S batteries in this car. Now, that really chaps my ass. If I can't run 5S, because I've got like three uh, 2S batteries, um, hopefully I can run 5S in this. I'm going to try that low voltage thing. Um, if I can run 5S in this, and you know, I won't be that bad, but I'm not looking super forward to going out and spending another $100 on a, a charger and battery. Because uh, I found, actually, there's two two batteries that I like using. That, ooh, I got a my re wheel on my remote starting to loosen up. Um, the Goldbat, there's a Goldbat 6S battery for $41. And there's a Pavway 6S battery for 42 or $43. So that's not too bad. That I can handle. That's fine. Um, I think it would be great, though, if they could get, um, uh, I don't know why a 4S charger couldn't charge a balance board with a 6S lead on it, you know. It, really the power is all you're concerned about and they could taper that off into six leads from four absolutely it's just the power you're after actually you wouldn't even need to you could just put plug in the 4s um, lead into your balance or into your charger 
and have a 6S balance board, you know, connection. Shouldn't be a reason why not at all, because it's just the power you're after. And you could distribute that, that power to as many leads as you want it. Oh, I don't want those rocks right there. Um, but I'm, I'm, I'm after one of these jumps. These are a great little series of jumps here. But they won't let me play. I'm gonna get my tires clean here. I know these aren't very exciting videos here, but basically I came up here to test that 5S. And it wasn't until, you know, it turned on and everything really good and the wheels spun and the, you know, my steering worked. So I was like, oh, sweet, it works. And I did notice that it counted down to 6S even though it's 5S. Um, um, so I was a little worried about that. But it wasn't until my ride over here that... Um, I decided to read an article about it, and they said, "Yeah, it works, but you have to use your low voltage. Uh, turn up your low voltage cutoff." So yeah, these these hobby park tires kick ass, and I don't know if they're hobby park tires, but Hobby Park is a brand that sells them, and I've seen them from other retailers as well. And, you know, they're, they're all around the same price. Except, you know, some of them will come with the, uh, the lug wrench. Which is very helpful if you don't have one. But these cars come with one. Um, a cheap one. The Arma, my Arma 3S car came with one. Nice little cheap one. Um, these cars come with a, a heftier one. That is a multi-tool. A multi wrench. I didn't know that till I bought this one because it was brand new. My other two 6S cars I got um, second hand. I wouldn't say used really, but they were second hand. It's like people just buy the things to um, sell them. I'm being surrounded. I think I might be able to get over there real quick, but I'll guarantee by the time I walk over there, someone's gonna be over there. This thing's getting really heavy on my uh, on my arm. Yeah. So I'm gonna, I keep talking about getting a lanyard and I, every time I <coughs> order stuff off Amazon, I don't remember to do it. But yeah. Um, if you buy the upgraded version of this transmitter that I'm using, it's like another $20. It's a little bit better and it comes with a lanyard. I do not want to smack them rocks, boy. Yikes. tell you this thing rides so low to the ground Ooh, look at that you don't want these guys in here big old boulder yeah so so much for keeping my car clean I can give it a little <clears throat> bath at the end yeah so I don't know these uh these uh, smaller cars well, this lower to the ground cars, um, they don't handle this quite as good because it's pretty rocky.
super dry out here so it's just dust yeah I don't I don't like doing this when there's so many people here get a bunch of spectators who don't like what you're doing Boy, this thing is squirrely. You know, I don't know if, uh, some headgear or something. Well, I have it. Just looks ridiculous. Um, with the freaking smartphone hanging off of it. <laughs> Alright. I got the dust raising is part of what people don't like about these. But the rain is certainly washing some of this stuff away. Yeah, it lands a little bouncy for my liking. Um, I have more fun with the... Uh, but really, I, I like the Typhon a lot. Um, I like the 3S Typhon so much. Um, that... Um, that and, and the complaints, the gripes I have with that car are the, you know, just the, the full plastic drivetrain. The only metal part is the pinion. Ooh. Yeah, so, this car runs lighter diff fluid than, uh, Than the Mojave or the uh, the Creighton center diff fluid, I think, is substantially uh, lighter. But yeah. I'm going to show these tires again after, like, uh, the end of the summer, if they hold up that long. I don't know if they will. We'll see. I don't know. Probably not. It seems like it's tracking pretty straight. You put power to it, though. I 
don't like them, how slow the return is on them. Oh, seems a little squirrely. I have some gyro. Yeah, that's different. Okay, that little bit of gyro made. I'm not a big fan of gyro. It doesn't seem to have much use, but for for two dollars more, um, you might as well get the gyro receiver. This, the non-gyro one's fourteen, and this one's sixteen. All right, uh, so it's a fail on the 5S. We'll try next time. See ya.